Okay, here's the tutorial for how to make a Christmas tree. This was my first example. And so I'm just going to go all the timeline back all the way to the beginning. I'll show you how I created that. Um, so uh, we're going to go ahead and start with a sketch. In this case, I'm going to airplane in the sketch. Square it up so I can get that to it on. Um, Circle. The first one that I put down, I just put it in dimension three inches. And then um, I'm going to put these in because I know I want them right around. And that is going to be an offset circle to that. Another way to do that is by the state body can be and, um, I'll tell you what this is for. Uh, it's not probably what you think it is. It's not the piece of the wall. Um, it's to trim off the designs of the text. Um, and there we go. Uh, so I shouldn't have ended that sketch. I need a line here. I'm going to put a line that is vertical. Line to the vertical y axis all the way through the bottom. And this way. And I actually don't need this stuff on this side anymore, so I turn it off. And there it is. So this is your, this is your common uh, evolve. So we evolve. We hit the evolve tool here. It's a new, and then in this box. What, what do we want to evolve? Long and then so we're picking to the I'm going to try and pick that first. And then the first, after you pick the profile line of evolve, you pick the new axis. So that's it. Um, okay, so um, then I'm going to evolve it over it all. It's worth mentioning that you don't have to be a full to change the amount that you evolve. So you can see it's like an inch slice. Sha -sha 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 -sha. And then I'm just going to show it. So you got a little blow here you have All right, so just like there's a form cover case, what I'm going to do now is this thickening this thing, and that's what's actually going to give the material uh, wall thickness. Uh, we're going to print these with clear materials, so we don't have to take them that thin as I did in my first example. So I dare say uh, one more. So I'm going to take them in. Since this model defaults to inches, you can see that one million thickness right there. That may be a little bit more than I need. So I'm going to add that. Seven. That's probably right there. Okay, so I'm going to accept that. Now, before I split this, I actually, that'll be my next one. Let me go ahead and split this and uh, pull these two together. So I'm going to pick on this one. And that's hit the split tool. I'm gonna split this thing and then over here and just need to split the lid. Okay, the next thing is I want to put a lip to hold these snappy things together. So I'm gonna take a section of the press I can look at the middle of something. And I'm gonna put the stuff down so I'm looking through the middle. I'm gonna have no show on the left hand side. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's actually the top of You know what? I, I realized this is a good thing. And I made this uh, thickening, so I'm going to double click to edit it. I forgot to make a new. I want to make it a new second. I forget these things in the uh, Now, that is what we see here and here now. And what I ended up doing is. Um, the split and then delete it from the video. So, um, 
I'm going to go ahead and turn this into you. Here, it makes a mess. Again, now I'm putting this shell, the bar shell, part two, and then into the split. And now I'm going to turn lower, and I'm going to go back to section view so I can see to the middle. There's a reason I do this, because I like to come in here and select to it. And uh, I'm going to add a lip to the top part here. And so how I do that is I'm going to actually go ahead and sketch right on this bottom room. It's going to be this. Okay. Yes, I'm going to use. Uh, use that code right down there. And then I'm going to offset it. And I am going to offset it here. And I'm just going to turn up the yellow match to the thickness of the bottle itself. That was pretty good. There we go. And um, I can set it. Enter. Step down. And there we go. Um, and what I'll have to do here next is I will have to. Um, uh, extend this. So I'm going to actually use um, I'm going to go into a center point circle. Now I'm just going to trim these out. So I'm going to trim that to the inner wall up there. That. And another one. I'm out. Trick for this one. See how it's making it a horizontal snappy to a horizontal line? Well, I mean, a lot. It's a culture for the pinches. So, line, I'm done. Now I have the profile I want. I'm going to go ahead and cut those back out. And so, all I really want is this. Um, it's not a it's not a closed profile yet. Um, over here, so I have to hit the news one more time. Is that there? So now it should be. I'm not really quick because I want to use that. You see that? Okay, I'm going to go ahead and bring it. This part will hit the news to the room. There's the room. I don't think we have escaped. There's a problem here. I need that to make sure it does come to There it is. You see how it shaded it now? That means it's on this one. Now, let me go back up here to this view and try on for another level. I can add this to the top or the bottom. I said I was going to add it to the top. It's really cool. And then do the report. It's not shown here, so I'm showing it. And it. Yes. Two parts. That's right. Now it adds that with us. So these two things can snap together. Put the lights inside, and now I just need a uh, top port here. So I'm going to make that into the next. I have to take the sections in here. So we're going to, uh, I guess, to make this easier. I'm going to do this easier and more straightforward way, which is to make an offset here for the top of my ball that looks like two. Maybe this two inches offset plane, and then put that on the base. And this is for the uh, ball. Um, so, um, uh, I believe I know the method that has. Yeah. 
It's a half inch. So a half inch standard opening on those Christmas dollars like that. I'll do an offset of that. Um, that, and then I'm done. And then I can do this like that. Screw And then change the direction. I'm going to add this up to that. And not only, but up to next, I can only stop. It's just it goes on this fit. And go ahead and set that. Uh, one more trick that I need to do here is to do a. Um, so I'm actually going to bring this to the back. And uh, use it to remove. And, this side means opens Put your hook attachment uh, right onto the action. Because I didn't tell us that to Let's just go ahead and do this session here. Yeah, that looks good, yeah. And now, at this point, you've made a blog, and you can put it in it. It's got nothing up. Huh. But let me show you really quickly how to approach it. And you're going to want to do the same thing for the screen tool. And uh, what I did for that top neck, um, which is using all the um, it doesn't really matter, but um, yeah, I'm just going to use that and I'm going to use that and I'm going to use that stretching. Now, I am, for the purposes of this video, always simplify this portion of this video. You're going to take your time to make something. Hopefully, on here. if you want to do sketch and text and do text on here, uh, for example, now you can see it's really <laughs> um, yeah. I think we have, I want to say we have new text, but if you are not, welcome to the difficult text of the news. Watch, I can mention the top. Two inches long, and um, it's also mirrored because I'm not sure. The new normal long did that. I can take care of it. So, I'm going to right click on it. Yeah, I'm going to now I'm going to do So I'm going to do that in this place. And so I'm going to extrude it. And I want it to go to next. I want it to go to next. So um, I'm going to go back to next. Again. I want it to end. And I want to only say that in there. Now, it's probably going to give me that. No, no. So, I, the, re, the thing we're going to do is actually make it move. Let's see what I'm going to do. So, we're going to do this. We're going to make it move. Okay. Go all the way through to the ball like that. And, um, just finish it. Okay. And now I got to split it. So I split this, 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 this. And you just split it. Move. 
Just like the devil. Now I split all of those. And I need to split them once again. But this time, with the original sketch that I did, I had a ball. Sorry, ball. And in this case, I'm just a surface. Just like the bob axis. And pick that vertical axis. Okay. And now I'm going to just put all of this stuff into this. 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 Now it turns that stuff into all. And I'm not going to keep the tools. I'll just put one side. Oh, okay. All right, there it was. And now I can finish my building operation. I can add stuff to the back. I need that. That's one part now. Yeah. Now I can see I have two parts, all parts, and there's still one thing terribly wrong, which is this stuff. So, um, uh, I can trim those off that same way I just trimmed off the outside. Just make that sphere surface and trim them off. So I'm just going to end it here because hopefully we're almost all done.